Thank you for being a Patreon member. Today I want to show you my seedlings. As you know, if you've watched any of my videos, you know that we plant seeds every month of the year. I generally try to plant three days before the full moon because I believe that the moon cycles affect the way that seedlings come up. And over the decades, I've noticed that they do better if you actually plant a few days before the full moon, but that is not what this video is about. I'm going to show you these plants here a little bit. This one we planted about a month ago, and so these little seedlings are about four weeks old. And then this one was about two weeks ago, and then we had another tray here that was about a week ago. So this one here, the seedlings are not coming up yet, but we can look at this right here. And it's only been a few days. I know I said a week, but sometimes things come out of my mouth that shouldn't. And so here's a weed right here. We can pluck him out. We can take this one and that out. Those are... Those are weeds, and that one, and that one, and that one. So there's a few <coughs> weeds. Sometimes a weed will come up, and that's okay, because we just got rid of them. But this is lettuce, and you can see they're not all coming up very good. This is normal in hot weather. When you're planting cool weather crops in hot weather, they don't do as well. And this tray here, you can see there's several dead ones in here. They just don't do as good in the hot weather, but that's okay because we still can grow food from the ones that do grow. Here's a trick for hot weather growing. Have a pan, these, this is a big oversized pan, This these cookie sheets, they won't fit in a normal kitchen oven. These are a really big one that go, <coughs> these are really big cookie sheets that fit in a commercial kitchen oven. And you can find these in the trash behind restaurants. So, you go to dig in the trash, and hopefully that helps you to be a fantastic gardener in the summertime.